What's going on guys? Deadly here and today I'm bringing you a little bit of... I almost said Modern Warfare 2 uh, because I'm actually watching a Modern Warfare 2 stream right now with Tabes. Um, no, I'm not watching it right now, right now because that's very unprofessional and I wouldn't focus on the commentary. But I will be watching was I will be watching it and prior to this I was watching a little bit of it and he's playing like Modern Warfare 2 and I almost said, hey guys, welcome to Modern Warfare 2 reskinned. Um, but no, Black Ops 2 as usual on express um which i guess is is rightly named although i'm surprised they didn't name it underground activision uh yeah activision uh last year they named underground a train station map that wasn't underground it was it was a ball um but anyways not here to talk about naming maps i'm here to talk about something really weird that happened to me it was kind of it was kind of scary and uh since you guys since you guys uh seem to like the last time i told you guys a scary story i decided you know what why not do it again so i was watching a stream last night it was around nine o'clock and i was kind of bored i'm like maybe i should just head to bed early there's nothing to do i don't really want to get an xbox i don't really want to i don't really want to do anything just head to bed and then I got a notification on my phone. You know, it went because it's uh, it was on vibrate. Which I don't know if I'm the only one who does this. Just keeps their phone on vibrate. I hate having my phone on uh, ringer. I guess I I just hate hearing phones ring. And I kind of go into this fit of rage and I turn into the Hulk. I don't turn green. I just get massive and uh, destroy everything. But uh, yeah, so don't don't put your phone on ringtone mode because I tell you what. Uh, no, I don't know. I don't really care about other people's ringtone. I just hate it when my phone rings. I'm not sure why. But anyways, it vibrated and I checked and it said, Oh, uh, if you didn't know, Mr. Phantasmo is streaming because Twitch gives you alerts if you allow it to. And so I'm like, yeah, okay, I'll watch the stream. There was nothing to do. It was perfect timing. So I start watching the stream and about three hours into the stream, uh, I hear... No, no, not only that, I'm in my room by myself. And um, everyone else is sleeping because uh, uh, parents have to go to work. Uh, my brother's in his room doing whatever, and my little brother's sleeping. So uh, yeah, everything everything is uh, the house is dead quiet, you know. And I'm just listening to the stream. Now, for whatever reason, I never put two headbuds in to my ears. Like obviously, I don't put two in one ear. That'd be horribly painful. But um, I don't ever put both of them in. I either have my uh, right one in or my left one in, and it's usually my right one if it's like middle of the day and I expect phone calls or in case someone calls, I could just answer it with my headphones. Uh, but at night, I just I typically put the left one in only. So, anyways, I only put the left one in, and about three hours into the live stream, which is about like half an hour before uh, it actually ended, I heard a clap right next to my ear, just like just like a regular clap, like someone clapping their hands. Now, instantly, I'm like, oh, what was that in the game? And then it, it comes to my attention that I don't have a headphone in my right ear, which is where I heard the clap, and I only heard it in my right ear. I didn't hear it in the left, so it, it's impossible for it to have been in the game. And that's when I realized, like, what was that? Like, what the heck just happened? What made that clapping sound? And I look at my closet, because that's where all the monsters hide, you know, the closet. I instantly look at my closet and see that it's open. And I'm like, okay, hold on. Let's be rational about this. Maybe my closet door opened and hit against something on the floor, making a clapping sound. Or what I thought to have been a clapping sound. So, naturally, I get up and check. And there's absolutely nothing near the closet door. And uh, there's just nothing around the floor, like, you know, the floor's spotless, so it couldn't have hit anything and just made it roll away. So now I'm thinking, like, what, what the heck just happened? Like, there's, like, my closet door, I'm pretty sure was open the entire time, so it's not like it opened and made the sound. And I'm just like, what the heck? So, naturally, being, being me, uh... I get up and go to the bathroom because that's that's what you do in all the scary movies and uh, I go to the bathroom I take a pee and I come back and I lay down in my bed right and I'm like okay maybe maybe I should just keep watching the stream just to kind of get my mind off of that and uh, I, I start watching the stream again when all of a sudden there is like 
walking in my closet. I don't know how to explain it. Like, my closet is not that big here. If it was at my other house, it'd be a walk-in closet. And uh, I don't want you guys to think I have like, this fancy big room. No, it's just, I don't know why the person who made the thing decided to make it a walk-in closet. Like, my room isn't even big enough to have a walk-in closet. Like, I could just put another person in my walk-in closet and use that as a room is what I'm trying to say. Like, the, whoever designed my room, horrible designer. Nonetheless, uh, if, that, if it was at my house, my other house, because... I live in New York uh, in in the summertime, and I live in Illinois in the school year. Uh, if I was at Illinois, okay, I would be like, okay, that's that's probably possible. Someone just snuck into my room and is in my closet, and then I would just lock the closet, and they would starve to death. However, here in New York, my closet's not so big. How how is there walking in my closet? And then I hear like scratching on the door, and I'm like, oh my god, there, there's two things happening right now. I'm either going insane. Or there's something about to kill me and uh, naturally I did what everybody else did uh, does I mean close their eyes and hope to fall asleep I eventually did fall asleep and uh, in retrospect I probably should have checked that out I don't think it was a smart idea just to go to sleep especially if there was something in your closet I probably should have just checked that out um, but I don't know. Hope you guys enjoyed this commentary. If you guys did, let me know in the comment section below. And let me know a scary time or a scary thing that happened to you. Uh, if anything has happened to you. Like I said in my last commentary where I talk about ghosts, uh, nothing's really happened to me that was scary. I think this is the first time where I've been genuinely scared that something was out to get me. <laughs> um, but other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed, like I said before. And uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Other than that, peace. And I said subscribe weird. Subscribe. All right, peace.